Hi y'all, this is So So Blessed. Welcome to the Blessed Place. How y'all doing? And um, I'm not gonna put out this vlog because I have nothing to say. Okay, today is August 27th, and my birthday is tomorrow, August 28th. And my mom is gonna give me a birthday message. What would you like to say to your baby? Oh, I just want to your say oldest ha baby. Ha happy birthday to my oldest daughter, 51 years, 1966. And my husband's in the army. I was so happy to have such a beautiful baby. And look what she has blossomed into a beautiful flower. So happy birthday and pray that you have many, many more birthdays. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> Uh, we're, we're in Hobby Lobby, Lobby <laughs> and they're acting the fool. Hi, <laughs> me. That's them. <laughs> this is Danica's first time in Hobby Lobby. Yes, it's so fun. Nobody <laughs> told me anything. <laughs> it's so fun in here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Lazy, get up! Oh, gee! What else is, what am I supposed to do? And stand over here in front of it so that way you can pull these legs off. No, stand in front of it and pull the legs off. Well, don't be recording this. <laughs> Watch my fingers. One hand over here. Watch my fingers. Well, if your fingers stay... Oh, yeah. <laughs> here. Praise the Lord, saints, can'ts, and ain'ts. It's Sunday. It's time to give him praise. I hope y'all give God some praise because truly he is worthy to be praised. Not just on Sunday, but every day. But especially fail not to assemble yourself together with other believers. Y'all be blessed. But they that wait upon the Lord, they shall renew, he shall renew their strength. Amen. He let you know that you don't have to worry about old strength no more. Amen. Amen. That he's going to give you some new strength. But in that equation, you got to be able to wait upon the Lord. Yes, you got to be able to have some patience Amen. on this journey. You got to be able to say, well, Lord, here I am. I'm not going nowhere. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting on you, God. Amen. I'm waiting on you, God, because you're still God. You're still the one. You're still awesome. I don't care, God, what the wives say, how the children are acting. Uh -huh. But I'm waiting on you, God. I don't care that my bills are funny. But I'm still waiting on you, God. I don't care, God, what nobody else says. I'm still waiting on you, God. I'm reminded one of the greatest things that I've seen about waiting on God. Mm -hmm. I was at this football practice. And it started raining and it started lightning. And so they dismissed the football practice. It was a Pop Warner game. A Pop Warner football practice. And so the kid had to be about maybe 10 or 11 years old. 
and the rain began to rain. Mm -hmm. The lightning began to the light strike all over the place and it began to thunder. So me and, and the father that I was with, he said, I know that young man. Let me go get him. So we rolled over there in the truck. We said, come on, come on, we'll, we'll, we'll take you home. He said, I'm waiting on my father. He told me don't, don't move. He told me to wake right here. We told him, that's okay. I know your father. Get in. I'll take you home. He said, I'm waiting right here. He said, he, he said your man, it's raining. And it's lightning. You can get straight by this lightning. Get in the truck. I'm sorry, sir, but I'm waiting on my father. And I was looking at him like, I would got in the truck. Amen. <laughs> but this young man, he understood one thing. His father gave him a word. Yeah. And told him to wait right there. And he said that I'm waiting <clears throat> on my father. Amen. I'm not going nowhere. I don't care what you said. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting on my father. Because he understood the principles. If my daddy told me something, uh -huh. that he's going to come through. Amen? Amen. This is how we have to get in our lives. If God tells us something, if our fathers tell us something, we got to learn how to wait on God. My stripes, we are healed. Hallelujah.